Hey guys, this is Dorian Day and welcome to Serum In Depth number 31. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use LFOs as envelopes. So a couple bummer things about the envelopes in Serum are you can't sync them to um, the grid. You can't draw points on them so they're not customizable. Um, you can't do one shot triggering, so they're pretty limited, but the LFOs are pretty powerful and you can do pretty much all of those things using the LFOs. So let's see an example. Um, well, first let's just use it to control volume on this oscillator. Whoops. Now you see it's working, but it's not really predictable because it's running as an LFO right now. But if we hit envelope, every time we press it, it just does a one shot and trigger. You hold it and it does it over and over again. So um, I was using this to try and do different kinds of pitch changes, maybe like you'd see in a kick. And this way you can have different pitch stages. Um, or you could one-shot a filter. How would we do that? Probably turn on legato and then make this envelope. And then we keep her scale. Yep. Legato, make sure that, that the yeah, makes it makes sure that the LFOs aren't re-triggered on note uh, presses. So, so we got a base, a filter. So now um, we have one shot envelopes. So I can press a, ba uh, a bass note, the filter engages, and then I can press another note while the uh, first note's held down and switch to it without re-engaging the envelope. If I turn off legato, so there you go. That's how you can use uh, Serum's LFOs as custom one-shot envelopes that are BPM synced also.